And hello wherever you happen to be watching from Carrow Road in Norwich. I'm your match commentator Derek Ray and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Norwich City up against Crystal Palace. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. the Norwich City starting 11. Well, it's a 4-3-3 formation with a centre-forward and two wingers. So it's important that the midfield players give support to the striker whenever the ball goes wide. They can't allow him to be isolated. Well, this is the team Crystal Palace have picked. Yeah, the same formation and the same sort of game plan. So this will all be about which individuals can get the better of their opponent. This will be a tough battle. Thank you for attending Cannon Road. Enjoy the match. And now they get the ball rolling. The referee correctly decided to play advantage. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. Les Melou. Byram Puki and that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger Delivering it. And mopping up defensively. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Taken short. Rashica. Plattered away. Temo Puki. And a super header. It looked as though it might be going in. Well, they've started the game really brightly here, and they've looked dangerous. But that was a top class save from the keeper. Brilliant from him. And space for the cross. Must take the lead here. And they have. You've got to say, it has been coming. Well, just look at this. It's a good finish and reward for their pressure. They really have controlled this game. intervention 
Les Melou. McLean. And snuffing out the danger. Ezzy. Jean Philippe Mateta. And blocked for now. They take it short. Cuts it back. Oh, that is a majestic goal! Volleyed home with precision and style. Superbly done. Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback. But you do have to ask questions of the keeper. Could he have done better here? I think so. You can't be beaten at your near post like that. So underway again here on the back of that leveller. Oh, great vision. Just showing a real will to win the ball. Ezzy. Will Hughes. Palace now in potentially a dangerous position. Eberechi Ezzi on the ball. It's a neat move. Well, the teams are locked together. Will it stay that way following this corner? Trying to deliver it accurately. And he succeeds in scraping it off the line. Intelligent threaded pass here. Joel Ward. Maximum commitment and he's given away the corner. Who can he pick out? They survived the attack. Williams. Puki. Now, what can they do from here? Byron. Looking for that final pass. Looking for the goal that would put them ahead. McLean. And offside, unfortunately. <laughs> Jeffrey Schlup. Gallagher. Fruitful looking attack. They do pass the ball with authority. And teammates to play it to. McLean. It's Rashica on the ball. Puki. Les Melou. And taking it away. Well, the electronic board showing three additional minutes. Deserves credit for winning the ball back. Schlup. Could be. Nice 
nicely blocked. And so it is, the first half story has been written. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, they weren't at their best, but with that equaliser, you can see why he's so important to this team. Hopefully they can get more of the ball to him in the second half so he can show us his ability. Underway then in the second half. And the two teams matching each other just about stride for stride. Byram. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Easy meet for the goalkeeper. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's been denied. And they remain locked together. Well, that's a good save, but really he should have scored from there. That's a big chance. Les Melou. Kenny McLean now. Rashica. And unable to keep possession. Counter-attacking very much an option. Succeeded in keeping it in play. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? Could play it in. Teammate available. Fluency of movement. Firing it towards goal. Very much run of the mill as saves go. Well, this is a really good game of football. Both sides have played well going forward. There's been plenty of chances, goals and a lot of near misses. It's been great entertainment. Conor Gallagher. Using his strength to shield the ball. Will Hughes. He got in the way of that cross. In it goes! He's made it a brace for himself. No stopping him, apparently. Well, here it is again. He's alive to the situation. He makes good contact with the ball, and he keeps it down. That's a nice-headed goal. is here Pukki the referee knew that was foul play but advantage it is read it magnificently and intercepted Schlup Moving forward effectively. Jeffrey Schrupp. Oh, really good reflexes and danger averted. Well, the referee let it go initially, but now he goes back and cautions him, Stuart. Yeah, it's a good bit of refereeing. He tried to let the play continue, and then he came back for the booking. the delivery and the danger is averted he takes aim and it's gone in the teams are separated by two goals now you cannot say they don't deserve it well here it is again and if you are going to clear the ball, you have to get height and distance on it to give your defence time to readjust. And they don't do that. It's a poor clearance. And suddenly, the ball's in the back of the net. Christian 
So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Cookie. Disappointing pass. Schlup. Encouraging move from Crystal Palace. Possession one. Possession given away, unfortunately. Gallagher. Ezzy. Oh, nice ball. Decent position. And now they have the ball back. This might be ideal for the counter. Les Melou. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. He knew he had to make the tackle and did. Les Melou. Might be a chance here. Well, to think he only had the keeper to beat. Couldn't take the opportunity. Joel Ward. Gallagher. Ward now. Anderson. Hudson Edouard. Good looking sequence. Preferring to go infield. Very comfortable when in possession. And no worries for the goalkeeper. And we will have a couple of additional minutes at the end here. Pull from the keeper and they'll come again. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Veering in field here. And there goes the final whistle. One that got away as far as Norwich and their fans are concerned. Well, Derek, I thought it was a subpar performance from them. Just didn't look as sharp as normal. And I don't think they deserved anything from the game. They need to get a better performance in next time out. Well, really, no complaints whatsoever about his performance in this game, Stuart. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder. Took his goals well, too. Clearly the difference maker today.